It's gonna be fit for it's gonna be fit for Washington with that with that front seven for Michigan. But it's gonna be, it's gonna be fun to see how it's gonna be fun to see how Pettit can react to having had to scramble around that much. He's gonna have to use his legs a lot. Obviously, he's not gonna have like you said. He's not gonna have one of his weapons. But I think that. I think that Washington has the, the offensive firepower to really kind of try to air out Michigan and see what that secondary is really hitting for, but you got to have the time to do it. Now I'm worried about Washington's defense against their own line and their running game because them boys are going to have that two-headed horse just beating these boys down to get later in the game. But right, and uh, even even Texas that was the that was one of the main concerns uh, come from Washington, and that's that's a good fact right there. Washington line is pretty good, but. Uh, Shout Texas out to our guy, D line, the coach. Facts. Shout out to coach. Texas D line was was supposed to give Washington the most issues. That's what Washington talked about throughout the week. How are they going to deal with the interior of Texas D line? There's really some monsters in there, and at times it did create problems. But I think that Washington's play calling was so excellent. You know, getting the ball out so fast, the guy with a quick release, and the running game really changed things. And really, when you get Michael Penix out there on the ground. That's when you start getting a little different because we ain't seen Michael Penix run all season. <laughs> Honestly, I haven't seen it at all. I, you know, previously I was worried because all the injuries, but now I guess I'm good with it. So I'm gonna take Washington to win this game. Uh, I think the Pac-12 going out with a bang. We haven't made any noise in the college football playoff. Washington went there once before with Jake Browning. Now they're back. You know, with, with, with a different motivation. You know what I mean? So give me Washington to be Michigan. I think Michigan chokes. I think uh, we see J.J. McCarthy revert back to his natural self, which is nothing. <laughs> we see Corum do his thing. But I think that this Washington team is rolling 13-0 for a reason. I'm going to roll with as much as as much as much I think that it's going to be a storybook ending for Harbaugh and we're going to see him this all this NFL chatter smoke. I'm rolling with Washington. I'm a fan of Penix. I, I like wow. that. I'm a, I'm a roll with Washington. Now I okay. I'm roll Washington out of my personal out of my like my personal me wanting to see them win because I'm a fan of Penix. I've been watching him throughout the season and seeing that, that the talent the kid has is is, is awesome. I'm hoping that I'm hoping that where where maybe some of these draft picks might shake up. I might be able to see my boy come back to Tampa because he's from there. Um, but kind of why I got my Bucks beanie on. Um, I think Michigan. I think it's going to be how it's what it's almost being built up to look like. Like, it's a hardball. Oh, they hated on him. They, they took him away from the team, and he still overcame it. And and they, he finally wins Michigan a thing. But I'm rolling with Penix, dog. You know what? Y'all two. Th- th- hey, thank you, Josh. Shout out to HBCU Nightly, my boy, Josh. Thank you, Josh. Thank you, Josh. I like I I knew I knew we I rock with you. Y'all want to choose Michigan? Cool. But when we come back on here for this this season in the wrap up, just know, just know I'm talking trash when they lose. All right, forget the huskies, bro. Y'all y'all showing too much support. That's like, we ain't even getting that much support from y'all. What's this? <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Fine. Hey, Oregon, y'all did. Oregon, y'all did a great job versus Liberty. I must say, too. We we didn't talk about that in the recap. Y'all did a great job. Y'all really that's showed them they Liberty, did not deserve man. to be in any type of playoff. That's that's. <laughs> hey, I got good news though. We didn't lose our bowl game because we didn't play one. <laughs> Is that a good thing? <laughs> hey, you can't hey. you can't can't lose a bowl game if you don't play one. Thank you. That defense causes too many problems. When you can sack yeah. somebody on their first six dropbacks four times, come on! What, like what we what we talking about right now? What we talking saw, about? If they can do the same thing, if they can, if I feel like if they can come out and establish that dominance early versus Washington and keep that consistent pressure, I just want to see it happen. I, I want to see Michael Penix under consistent pressure. And, and let me see how he performs throughout the whole game. Let, let me see Oregon that. Game. He the will first make Oregon me, game. He Kobe, will, you saw it. He will make me a believer. Because, I mean, forget us, all right, because we choke. <laughs> he will make me a believer if he can do that versus that defensive line from Michigan. He can make, he'll make me a believer. I swear he will. 
should be a good Y'all see any of those things in the slides of them talking about, like, some of the quarterbacks for this season of, like, things that have happened, like, throughout, like, going into college and, like, accomplishments. Hey, yo, 